Well, good morning, lovely ladies and gentlemen. Steve Collins coming to you from the beautiful Santerra Country Club in San Antonio, Texas, the second most powerful, passionate, purposeful coach and speaker in the world. I hope you guys are excited for this Friday and the weekend that you're about to have. Hopefully you poured out everything you could all week long and you're going into the weekend deserving of the rest rather than guilty because you didn't pour it on. I want to have a quick conversation. I'm excited today because today is our annual staff retreat. This is where we have uh, almost 40 staff members from the Keller Williams Heritage Office that will receive training, knowledge, wisdom, and impartation in order to grow personally and to develop as people. And so there's an old saying out there, well, what if I train my people and they leave me? And the second half of that is, well, what if you don't train them and they stay? Huh. Or how about Richard Branson's quote that I really love? He says, train your people well enough that they can leave you treat them well enough that they won't want to. So I ask you this, in order for you to raise the level of lives of those around you that you care about the most, your family, your colleagues, friends, in order for you to do that, were you aware that it really takes you being the forerunner? Had you ever considered that? It's kind of like putting the oxygen mask on in the airplane when they tell people, Put your mask on first before you put it on anybody else. If you're not intentional about your personal growth and development, if you're not intentional about becoming more than you currently are and basically maximizing your gifts and talents, I'm not talking about competing with anybody. I'm talking about doing the very best you can with what, what God gave you, not what he gave somebody else or anybody else. You see, when you do the very best that you can, and you give God the very best that you can, he can give you the very best that he can, which is typically gonna create more influence for you to impact more people's lives. So I ask you this, are you taking the lead? Are you taking the lead? Do you expect more from your leaders than you expect from yourself? Because you know what? If you're harder on yourself than you are on others, nobody can be hard on you. The harder you are on yourself, the less hard other people can be on you. So I challenge you this weekend. Are you intentional about your personal growth and development? Are you intentional about making yourself uncomfortable? Are you intentional about pushing yourself to the maximum limits? Well, Steve, how do I know I'm at the maximum limits when I push myself? Well, that's a great question. When you fail, when you crash and burn and you mess it up. That's when you know you've maxed your limit and now it's time for a new relationship or a new resource. And this, my friend, is the pattern of personal growth and personal development. So I wish all of you a great weekend and ask yourself this question. Am I leading by example? Or am I looking for somebody to be an example for me? Have a great weekend, guys.